Hello boys and girls, welcome to peek over my shoulder in uh, Oblivion Lost again and I'm giving another try uh, to the whole uh, run around around the NPP <coughs> objective because now that I was able to orient myself uh, more or less in a familiar way I didn't get lost, and yeah, I think now we are in the other side. Like that. That might be near the gate that we came in from. Okay, and this is solid ground, I know. Footsteps, I mean footprints. I know there are some, but. Uh, Okay, and now we are in the uh, area where we might uh, expect to run into choppers that we can stab. Also, I know that there will be uh, several sections of uh, fall through. Fall for textures on the ground here. So it pays to be careful. <coughs> oh, also, I was. I didn't remember to uh, check my settings. But I did turn on hot. But let's see, I'm just gonna eat something and then not worry about it for a while. And uh, the uh, purpose of these episodes <coughs> is just to go out and explore. Not even do anything substantial. Well, I mean, if a chopper gets my way then I will stab it, but in the grand scheme, besides maybe having a picnic, there's nothing in the agenda. Ah, oh, there must be this uh, cooling tower or something on the other side. I mean, visible from the other side. And if I'm not mistaken, then this uh, structure is separating the uh, the uh, cooling channels from uh, from Pripyat River. Oh, we have reached the edge of reality. Be careful not to fall through. It's the sea of nothingness and the unpredictable. Oh, and if I remember correctly, then the uh, slanted uh, surfaces were fall through as well. So I'm not even certain if I can get back up to the main stuff from this side. Ah, oh, it's a solid ground, okay. Are you solid? Yes. But that one over there ain't. I was looking for. I think the direction, even the direction doesn't match. This is a different gate altogether. Can I walk through these? No, 
Hmm. What do you know? Okay, let's let's try that way. I don't want to walk uh, all the way around from here either. Even in the twilight zone, there are fences to fend you off. Well, the sun isn't much help. But the sounds are telling me that uh, that the whole industrial area can't be too far because I can hear that uh, electrical thingy going off. It's like mega anomaly or something. Oh yeah, there they are. So that's where the fence is. Hop over this one. Uh -huh. Okay, I need a manual shape here. Mounts. Oh, and of course I can cross the thingy. Yeah, now I get it. These are railroads. And these are the rail and pumps. This is your brain on Twilight Zone. Scripted choppers was parked <coughs> somewhere on the lawn on this side of the uh, MPP. Okay, so there's our main hero. Whee! Hey, 
frame rate has just got better a little bit. Is it because the textures are missing? Provided that the uh, building textures aren't uh, solid. Okay, quick save. Run, jump. Okay, oh, and I can't. Oh, and I think now I'm trapped. <laughs> I'm trapped in this corner of reality. <laughs> no. Yeah, so that is the PSA about the dangers of Twilight Zone. You will never know when you when you hit an actual wall. Okay, I don't think I I have it in me to go and try the actual grenade jumps and, and such. Instead, since we have now conquered this land, I should go back to an earlier save. But which one? side of this, this right here. So maybe I do have it in me to do some grenade jumps. Just a few. Uh, do not quick save. Let's reload. So we shall not go there. But 
where will I go then? I don't quite want to make the long... Uh, the long way back either. It's not even that high. I think this is solid texture. Where was the other end of this fence? something solid here. Uh, now I think I remember where that one particular chopper is that I met before somewhere on this side. I think it's in the bottom of one of the uh, cooling, uh, cooling channels or cooling basins which just happens to have a fall through texture. Hello. I need to go in there. And you cannot stop me. What? Are you kidding me? Okay, now I'm near the bridge. I don't want to be near the bridge. To go back on this side. Now I know that the railroad this particular railroad bridge is not full through. So we are going on this side. This land is not full through either. And I want to see the chopper. 
Ah, this little stru structure. I think it's a pumping station. I think that's uh, that's what inhabits one of the texture holes on the other side. remains more or less the same. Check out the... Uh, huh. Check out the area. Avoid uh, triggering scuppered events. And if you see the chopper, stab it. story. Okay, uh, I'm gonna pause the recording. Well then, back at this point. So, mental note to self, do not step into anomaly. I do want to check out that chopper though.
I like it how when you... Hello. When you... Uh, when you see a random message. And then... Uh, oh shit! Crap! 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 No, 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 no! Brilliant! <laughs> uh, I'm gonna try to make the best scream over screenshot here. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Dangerous mutants, deadly anomalies. It is happening again. <laughs> okay, so. Some of those areas also keep eyes open. And there's military about, and there's monolith about, and actually they should be fighting each other. Landscape thingies. So yes, as I was saying, what I find pretty cool is about uh, when uh, when you see a random message and then uh, and then uh, reload from the similar spot. edges of this uh
Yes. seem to remember that if you got uh, too close to the gate on the right then uh, it triggered some event. Hello. I want to loot them first, if I'm perfectly honest. Okay, that is something else. Wasn't it? Yeah, I think the uh, chopper that keeps uh, <coughs> shooting at shit, uh, that one will uh, uh, will uh, blast a hole in the in the uh, uh, fence or something. <coughs> No, we do not want to upset the anomalies, no, do we? Run, 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 run. Oh, no, do that in the bus stop. What are you talking about? There's always do that in the bus stop and in the buses. Anybody out there? Is this tank operational? Can't remember. Can't remember shit. Okay, and I will turn on the hot so that I could see whom to loot. Pretty sure there were more buggers that way. Yes, please. Oh, come on. Why are you sending privates in this area? This is irresponsible. And the other one looted I'm not even sure if I can get to this one. Okay, so this answers that. Okay, this is the old body. This is an old body as well. That one. That one's an old body. Did I 
shoot him? I don't remember. I don't think so. Oh, I think these are the... Military and monolith in fight. Well, between interfight. through this uh, gate is gonna trigger something then I will pull back a little bit or reel in or whatever okay so far so good These pipes look exactly as if you could crawl through the uh, through the uh, fence using them. Okay, hard to go on in case th in case there are bodies. Huh? This one didn't fall here. A bummer. I bet he has all the juiciest artifacts. should have taken some of the batteries with me after all. Huh, I didn't see any bodies here either. Hey, I can go up there, of course I can. Are there more than one? Of course. Uh, well, I triggered something, didn't I? Okay, I now I triggered it. Okay, I'm going. I'm going to go back a step. Right, they are shooting at me. But I'm not sure where. <gasps> Red barrels. Stalker's delight. Ah, oh, I see. I see you. I'm gonna try it again. So, again. I wonder if it's location specific or something else specific. I know there's one to my left, and then there's 
just want to know about the proof. And I wonder if shooting him is a trigger of strike. It is! Oh, okay, in that case. So, we are at this again. I will try something here. I will try uh, to get up that structure. And I won't shoot any monolith. Because shooting them seems to trigger the chop off thingy. Trigger something, fucker. But I'm gonna pop the med kit. Okay. Oh, well, this is unfortunate. Um, um to the cover. Okay, and I, I can tell that the quartet has been summoned, so. This particular endeavor is not success, at least in such conditions. I can't, I can't sneaky here, but I want to con uh, continue sneak sneaky ink. So, so I will rem remain in this area for a little while longer. I know that there are s some trigger areas in this. Uh, this uh, part as well. But I do not want to trigger shit yet. I want to choose when I trigger the shit. Also, I, I know that uh, <coughs> when approaching from the other side uh, then, uh, then uh, if you get too close to the uh, to the train yard over here, uh, then the events uh, would also trigger. Well, what happens if I shoot you from here? Like clockwork. Meaning. What? So here we are again. Thing is, I, I uh, want to keep uh, beating around the bush some more. So I wonder if I have to go back to the twilight zone or something. Uh, because I know that if I go, uh, if I go too far near the NPP sign, <coughs> then I will trigger the attack. So apparently if I kill that bugger over here, then I trigger the attack. If I go too far inside this area, then I trigger the attack. And it would appear that uh, if I kill any monolith, inside the area, then I trigger the attack. And it kind of looks like... Ah, oh, okay, so that was one trigger. Right there. I think it was the hole in the, in the wall. Let's check out this... this body real quick. Whoa. I have too much stuff on me already. trigger area now. Oh, but it looks like that particular trigger does not trigger the choppers.
carry these extra weapons around. So, are we safe still or what? So reaching, uh, uh, reaching that sign from uh, one coming from the other direction. That's one, one surefire way to trigger the event. Huh? Hello. Let's see if you are a trigger too. Apparently, he was not a trigger. Okay, so I save here. Eh. And I want to try yet one more thing inside the fence. Namely, is it possible? Is it possible to uh, reach those stairs? Well, I, I will have to stay alive for that. To reach those stairs. And not kill any monolith on the way because that's a trigger. Reach those stairs and climb up there because I want to go and climb up there. shooting me from this side. Nope. Now remember, we are being sneaky here. Oh. And there they come. Okay. So let's listen in a little bit. Also, screenshots. an upcoming blowout or not because that's uh, that's what I'm really well that that's the th main thing that I'm trying to postpone is the uh, scripted blowout here and uh, before when the choppers triggered then uh, uh, then I heard uh, in the radio conversation that the uh, that the big blowout is coming so I'm guessing that uh, triggering the choppers and uh, triggering the blowout are connected. Anyway, I think uh, I'm wrapping up this episode and in the next one I will uh, 
I will actually uh, go back to Twilight Zone and circle around the area a bit more. So, uh, yeah, and I'm, I'm not going to record the whole process, I'm just gonna try and see where it takes me. So, bye bye for now. Thank you for watching, and see you later. Bye bye. A little encore in between episodes. I found out who's shooting me from this side. Stay down. Also, I need to leave the area. Okay, that was a success. Carry on. Oh, and I don't, I don't really want this, but I don't want to drop it here either. Anyway, onward to the toilet zone, and see you soon in an episode proper. Well, this is unfortunate. On my way through the toilet zone, I have a blowout proper. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what happens now. Let's see how far can I run. one, but there is the other one. Ruby! Okay, I'm going to reload and uh, let's proceed to the episode proper soon-ish. Let's see if we can someone go to the bus.
Thank you. 